Hi dear cricket fans, welcome to Cricket Happenings. This is your host Ram here. And well, what a match. I mean, uh, yesterday we were uh, talking about the match where India were really struggling at 82 for 6, 110 runs ahead, and Chris Martin was breathing fire at the time. But today, um, uh, well, what happened was India and not only saved the match, but put New Zealand under pressure. Even though the match actually ended in a draw, New Zealand definitely um, has a lot of them, a lot of things going for them, a lot of positives to gain from. But for India, we were all hoping that uh, W. S. Lakshman would actually, uh, you know, get us out of the woods. But uh, well, W. S. Lakshman, well, he definitely did a wonderful job. Uh, he missed his century by nine runs uh, due to a, a very doubtful LBW dismissal. Uh, probably the UDRS could have uh, really helped at that stage. He was uh, adjusted LBW bowl with Tori for 91. But let me tell you, the hero was Harbhajan Singh, who got his maiden test century, his first test century in his 88 test. Harbhajan Singh going on to make 115 of 193 balls with 11 fours and three sixes, entertained the crowd uh, to plenty. And just imagine, uh, the, we were 82 for six, and the seventh wicket, actually, thanks to the 163 run stand between Lakshman and Harbhajan Singh, it went the whole hog, 163 run partnership, and well, the bowlers couldn't really do. And there was, uh, the, I mean, we don't know what happened actually. There's no Hamish Bennett, and uh, Ross Taylor and Brendan McClellan were the ones who started the bowling. Uh, they actually bowled today, uh, and uh, well, it was not looking like New Zealand were really, really, you know, thrusting for victory uh, by the way things were. Uh, but well, the uh, let's give credit to Harbhajan Singh, 115. The way he played, he played only the way he does. He he just went for the balling, he attacked them, he showed good defense, uh, he was uh, hitting the ball uh, high over, he hit uh, Jitan Patel over long on for a six, uh, he got to his century in wonderful style by actually sending, uh, I think it was uh, Daniel Vittori who was soaring over the ropes uh, for a six over extra cover and also hit one more six. And well, let me tell you, Harbhajan Singh was entertaining the crowd to plenty, just his 11 fours and three sixes, because Harbhajan Singh, as you know, uh, he has his unorthodox way of playing, and he did that. But well, Lakshman was the one at the very, very stabilizing source at the other end, uh, just, you know, encouraging um, Harbhajan Singh. And Harbhajan Singh, one more thing that he said in his uh, match report after when he was interviewed by Ravi Shastri in Neo Cricket TV, uh, he said that, uh, uh, it was Mahindra Singh Dhoni who had a talk with him the other night, uh, telling him that this is the right time for him uh, to make a move and Harbhajan Singh show what the uh, show the world that he is capable of actually even staying there and making uh, a very good knock and saving India. And well, uh, it, uh, all in all, it actually helped India to not only save the match, but Harbhajan Singh getting his first Test century uh, in his 88 Tests. Uh, Anil Kumble and Chamin Dawaz were the persons who actually got their like 97 and I think 117 respectively so but uh, Harbhajan Singh got it in 88 tests so congratulations to Mr. Harbhajan Singh for getting a century and saving India and uh, what a match I mean uh, yesterday we looked like India were at the losing end and suddenly we find uh, that uh, this partnership really and um, I mean enlivened proceedings for India and uh, W.S. Lakshman, well, he played only the way he won. He was uh, absolutely graceful as ever, uh, stroking the ball through the covers, uh, playing it through the point, the cut shot, his driving, impeccable. And well, uh, as I said, uh, there was only that um, LBW thing which actually dismissed him. He felt nine short of his century, definitely deserved a century. It was LBW ball, Vettori 91. But let me tell you, Lakshman was the one, the binding force there. Once again, Lakshman showed uh, what a match winner he is for India. I mean, he, he didn't win the match, but he definitely saved the match. He has been, I would say, this season, Lakshman has been the savior of India. Not only now, we have always seen in the past two, W.S. Lakshman has always been a savior for India. And that's what he did. And he actually uh, helped Harbhajan Singh to get to his century. Harbhajan Singh thanked uh, Lakshman for that uh, thing. And Harbhajan Singh also said one thing, that uh, Sachin Tendulkar, Virinder Sehwag, and all his teammates were actually telling him that uh, he has a lot of capability. So Harbhajan Singh devoted this century to his team and what a way to do it. 
and at, at so the 228 for seven India lost their seventh wicket Lakshman was gone after that um, uh, Zahid Khan came in well he was LBW bowl wet Hori for a duck Pragya Noja was not out on none but well I think Lakshman and Harbhajan had taken India out, not only out of the woods but they are actually you know um, uh, uh, put up a very good position for India where they can't uh, lose at all and Shreesanth was caught Hopkins bowl Taylor Harbhajan Singh uh, was uh, caught Watling bowled uh, Ross Taylor for 115 of 193 balls, 11 fours and three sixes studded that wonderful effort from Harbhajan Singh. Keep it going, Harbhajan Singh. And the bowling figures, Chris Maher in 27 overs, 8 made in 63 runs and 5 because he couldn't make much of an impression today. Uh, he, he actually went for runs and Harbhajan and Lakshman really played him very well. Dan Everett, 38 overs, 8 made in 2 for 81. Jitan Pali, 23 overs, 1 made in none for 72. Uh, Kane Williamson, 4 overs, none for 18. Ross Taylor was the wicket taker today, 4.4 overs, 2 made in 4 rounds and 2 wickets. Brendan McClum, 6 overs, 1 made in none for 18. As far as New Zealand was concerned, it's just a formality there. The match was called off, um, uh, you know, uh, by with, with both the captains agreeing. And Tim McIntosh backed a pair in this match. He really needs to work on his batting. Today he was out to an in-cutter from Zahir Khan, which he had no clue about. And he was LBW for a, uh, for a duck. Brendan McClum was not out on 11. VJ Watling was not out on 2. 22 for 1, uh, New Zealand finished with uh, Zahid Khan, 4 overs, 2 maidens, 1 for 7, 3 cents, 1 over for 4 runs. Pragyan Oja, 3 overs, 2 maidens, none for 1. Suresh Raina bowled 1 over for 1 runs. And Mahindra Singh Dhoni, 1 over, none for 5. And that was the time the match was called off. Uh, so the first test match uh, of this uh, three test series is over with India saving the match and drawing the match. India, uh, so it is uh, level. So now again, we, uh, we get on to the second test match, which would be actually. Uh, starting on uh, well uh, I think it's in a matter of four days it should be starting and uh, it was a uh, player of the match was Harbhajan Singh without any a shadow of a doubt because of his first inning 69 and 115 a match saving effort in the second innings for India and his maiden test century Harbhajan Singh really really saved the day for India but okay again not taking any credit away from Lakshman Lakshman also played a stellar role and New Zealand well you did very well uh, they had a lot of positives coming out of this match. Yes, they definitely had uh, some uh, crippling problems. Hamish Bennett couldn't bowl. I thought he bowled well in the first innings, uh, but he couldn't take any further part in the game. But he's a good bowler. He's a player for the future. He was hitting the deck very hard. Probably he could have complimented Chris Martin yesterday. Again, uh, these are ifs and buts. And also, I could say that spinners also bowled well. Uh, the Kane Williamson was the best positive to come out of them. Jesse Ryder ran into form at the right time. Uh, and he also got a century. So... Uh, things are looking good. So New Zealand have uh, definitely, uh, you know, come up from that uh, drubbing that they received against Bangladesh, and they are showing uh, that they really mean business, and they are determined enough with their uh, end guns uh, to really fire on all cylinders. So good luck to New Zealand too. So the second test match will start uh, in four days' time. So right now I have enough time for you to take you uh, to the Dubai International Cricket Stadium, where the match is now underway. As you know, this is a very very crucial match, the fifth One Day International between Pakistan and South Africa, which is played at the Dubai International Cricket Stadium. The, as you know, it's level right now to all. And well, I have some breaking news too. Uh, that is a news which is coming out that Zulkarnain Haider is missing uh, in the hotel, which is very, very sad. Uh, one hopes everything is fine with Zulkarnain Haider. And um, South Africa currently, uh, what I have, uh, this is a live report coming from the Dubai International Cricket Stadium between South Africa and Pakistan, where South Africa won the toss and elected to bat. As you know, the series is uh, two all right now, and this match is very crucial. Whoever wins uh, this particular match will be taking the series. And what a very wonderful contested, very closely contested series this has been. Uh, both have not been giving an inch away, and and Pakistan have uh, really looked uh, got a bit of an edge, I would say. South Africa currently 104 for two. Uh, after 16.4 overs and let me just uh, go through the scorecard in fact it was Shoy Bakhtar who actually gave them the breakthrough today and Shoy Bakhtar had Hashim uh, actually had a Graham Smith caught by Shahid Afridi for 14 or 15 balls with three fours uh, and uh, Hashim Amla played a wonderful innings a very aggressive knock uh, he was stroking the ball perfectly Shoy Bakhtar was taken for four fours in one particular over Hashim Amla was also uh, is also gone caught Shoy Bakhtar bowled Shahid Afridi for 62 or 47 balls with nine fours and one six Jack Scalis is currently not out on 25. ABD Williams is not out on 204 for two. Uh, and as I said, this is a very, very crucial match. Shoy Bakhtar has been going all over the park. Four overs have cost him 37 runs. So dear cricket fans, uh, this is the time I'll be uh, actually getting ready to go for my office work. And I will have to curtail this uh, particular report. But I just wanted to bring you uh, this news that India have saved the match in the 
uh, first test match of the three test series uh, and um, well Harbhajan Singh was the hero with his maiden test century 115 of 93 balls with 11 fours and three sixes and where W.S. Lexan missed his century by nine runs uh, so he was the one the 163 run partnership for the seventh wicket actually saved India and well uh, that's it uh, India have once again proved what champions they are they definitely have all the talent uh, you know I, it was never happening but now uh, we have a lot of bowlers who can bat really well Zahir Khan can bat Harbhajan Singh can bat so that is something uh, which is uh, very good going for India I would say and as far as uh, this uh, Dubai International Cricket Stadium match is concerned uh, I'll be back with a full match report in the evening once I come back from my office that's it dear cricket fans for cricket happenings I just wanted to have uh, give you this um, very um, I mean I just wanted to share this uh, cricket happenings here uh, on the uh, Motera Stadium uh, in Ahmedabad as far as the first test match between India and New Zealand is concerned which has ended in a draw uh, until uh, till such time I come in the evening and actually give you the report on the South Africa versus Pakistan game which is again according to me is definitely going to be a close uh, contest uh, we all look forward to a very good con contest here uh, until then it's Ram bidding goodbye and all of you have a wonderful day thank you very much for your support